everybody, what's going on? It's the Ride the Work Podcast, and it's dark out, Edith. Yeah, I don't know. I, I forgot how it's supposed to go. It's supposed to be... In the summertime, it's light out earlier in the morning. In the wintertime, it's still dark in the morning. Is that how it's going? Well, anyway, it's September. So, I guess it's going to get a little darker there. But, um, anyways, uh, how's everybody doing? Hope you're doing well. Me, I haven't, I haven't feeling so good lately. I gotta get checked out, man. You know, hope I don't got anything seriously wrong. Cause I always, I always feel like, <laughs> I always, <laughs> uh, ladies, I'm sorry. Ladies, ladies, ladies. I'm sorry if this offends you, but fellas, you guys, you know, fellas, you might be able to, but, but ladies, if I offend you, I'm sorry, but, uh, gosh, dang it, this stupid book bag fell over, um, jeez, oh, I, um, I got, I get, I got this feeling like someone just kicked me right in the balls, like, all the time, I haven't, I had the balls checked out a while ago, and, doctor said they didn't see anything, but I just, I don't know, man, it feels like someone gave me the old fucking one-two right there in the friggin' gift bag, man, wow, oh, but anyway, so, <laughs> anyways, man, I was watching this video of this kid, well, the, now, let me tell you something, these YouTubers, man, I'm, I'm talking about, like, these real obsessed, these real obsessed, like, YouTubers, these real, like, Oh my god, I got so many followers, oh my god, like, what? what is it with that, with, I mean, you know, and if I offend some people about gayness and everything, well then, bye-bye, I'm sorry, you can unsubscribe, I don't care if I offend you, I don't care, I don't care, I'm like Ricky Gervais, I don't care, I don't care, I, I, shut the fuck up, I don't care, I don't, I don't care, so anyways, back to gays, um, yeah, there was this, like, he's like, I don't know if he's gay. Well, he's got to be gay, because I'm like, oh, my God. Like, what is it with the gays, with the, with the oh, my God, 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 oh, my God. It's just so, uh, it goes up my ass like something that goes up theirs. It just, it's, yeah, uh, it just annoys me. Oh, my God. Well, anyways, like, that's all this kid was doing. Like, they... They pulled him over, you know, he's driving a... <laughs> they pulled him over, he's driving a pink Mercedes. He's driving a pink Mercedes. Yeah, because that's what a real man does. Anyways, um, he's driving around a pink Mercedes and, um, yeah. He's driving around a pink Mercedes, cutting people off. You know, this and that. He's got this little bleach blonde hair and this kooky, like, half-sequins fucking jacket. And, I'm like, ah. And, um, so he's, like, he's, like, cutting people off. And this, well, this freaking, these guys, like, kind of, like, pulled in front of him after that and got out of the car. Like, the fuck you doing, man? Well, you know, just trying to, like, confront him. Like, hey, dude, you know? And, uh, he pistol whipped him. This dude got a gun. He pistol whipped him and, uh, you know, um, so he got arrested, but like when he was getting arrested, they were like grabbing him and put the cuffs on him. He's like, I'm like, ah, he threw him on the ground because he wouldn't get on the ground. He wouldn't get on the ground at all. So they put him on the ground. He's like, oh my God, oh my God. He goes, oh my God, what are you doing? Oh my God. Do you know how many followers I have? Oh my God. Like just, it's just so hard. Like th these are the men. This, these are the men that we got today. These are the. Suppose of men that we got. We're fucked. We're fucked. We're fucking screwed. If we get invaded, we're fucked. There's no guys, no men, young men anymore who are any type of fucking manly. And it's sad. Because that's what they're going to do. That's what they're going to do. They see, so they see, if we get invaded and they see foreign soldiers running up on our beaches and shit, they're going to go, oh my God, and they're going to fucking get killed. You know, all the real men are gone. They all, all the real men die with me. They die with my dad. They die with uh, my brother. We're all done. We're the, la we're the last of the last. We're the last of the last. There's no more, eat it! That's it. That's it. That's 
it. There's no more men. It's sad. I got a couple of shirts that say make men manly again. <laughs> pounds, some of, some of them weigh over 300 pounds, not because of a, a, a of an illness or anything, it's just they got themselves that way, okay, they don't take care of themselves, so they weigh like 300 pounds, and they got face acne, and then, you know, probably because they're on borderline diabetes, now they have glasses, and you know, they shave half their head, and the other side, they bleach purple, you know, and then they put like a bull ring through their nose, and they wonder why they catch a bunch of shit. It's like, look at you. You make yourself look like that, and then you got the then you got the balls to cry about it. And go, oh my god, oh my god, people are making fun of me. Oh my god, don't give people the ammunition. Look at what you're doing to yourself. Look at where you look. You make yourself look like that, and then it's everybody else's fault. Get the fuck out of here. No. I'm not buying the, oh my God, you don't understand. Yes, I do understand. Yeah, you might've got bullied in school. I mean, everybody had kind of like a little bit of a bullying, but that, when you did, when you had your bully experience or your or your situation, it was up to you whether how you handled it. It was up to you how you handled it. You either sat there and got bullied or you did some shit about it, you know? Some of them were, some people were even scared. Even if, even if you were scared, even if you were scared, you know, you, even if you were scared, you, 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 uh, you know, you, you did something. You, if you had to fight, you had to fight. You know, even if you knew you were going to get, some of us even knew if we were going to get our asses kicked, we still f fought. Because we're not going to be victims of a bully and grow up to be like, oh my God, and like just roll over and just let the goth makeup form as it will. <laughs> But I don't know. I don't want to get too excited because I don't feel good. I don't feel good on the Ride to Work podcast today. Eat it. But um, I don't know. Maybe it's because it's getting colder at night. My daughter freaked out last night. Like, she had this nightmare, I guess. she. I just heard this high-pitched scream, and I thought it was the TV. So I woke up. Then I heard it again. And uh, my wife is a badass. That's all I gotta say. My wife is a, my wife is a badass. My wife is a real straight up badass. Like she freaking, I rolled up off the couch because I was watching TV. I rolled up off the couch, which is closer to my daughter's bedroom, and I got one foot down off the couch. And I did like the splits and fell. But even as I was doing the splits and falling, my wife was already halfway into my daughter's room. My wife's a badass. She got out of that big bed, jumped to the floor, and ran to my daughter's room. I'm right there on the couch, closer to my daughter's room, and I did not make it. I failed. So, maybe that's another reason why the balls hurt this morning, but I don't know. Yeah, balls hurt, the, the balls hurt, the chest hurts, the legs hurt, the feet hurt. I don't know what the hell's going on with me, but maybe I got to start eating better. Or I don't know what I got to do. Just kind of makes me a little leery or a little like, eh, because like, man, there's people out there that smoke two packs a day that feel better than I do right now. So I don't know. But, uh, trust. <laughs> yeah, there's people out there who smoke cigarettes and still jog and shit. It's weird. It's like, that makes no sense. But I could, you could tell, I could hear, I could feel my voice getting raspy. Just, uh, I hate being sick. You know. I don't know. Maybe things are catching up to me, man. I mean, I, you know, I don't like to put my business out there. But when I was younger, man, I did a lot of partying. <laughs> you know, don't think I'm this this innocent guy who's just, you know, everyday man. Like, hey, all right, I'm, I'm, I'm cool. I ain't ever done anything. I'm, nah, man. I used to party pretty hard back in the days. So maybe it's catching up to me now. I, I haven't partied in like that in so long, but I don't know. Maybe it's catching up to me now. I don't know. But uh, I just got to get back in the gym like I used to. I used to be ripped. You know, I'm still okay, but I'm, I notice I'm starting to get a little paunch. 
down there, and I don't want that. And uh, I'm getting a little older too, so I need to fucking I'm getting a little older, so I need to, you know, start watching it. But uh, yeah. Anyways, what's everybody doing this weekend? What's your plans for this weekend? Are you gonna pull out your balls? <laughs> Yeah. Shout outs to MRE, Mob Rats Exposed, aka Rustin757. Hopefully every everything's going okay with him. I think I don't know if he was at a funeral, I think. So if uh sorry for his loss, whoever it may be. Uh yeah, get a hold of him, old Nick. Yep, yeah, old Nick the prick on Mob Rats Exposed. <laughs> nah, he's a good guy. He's a real good guy. Me and him have been friends for a while. We come from the same state, grew up in the same areas, knew some of the same people. You know, that's not hard to do up there though, because it's really, it's really small. It's really, you know, everybody knows each other's mother. <laughs> so yeah, hopefully everybody, uh, everybody does good this weekend, and uh, you know, don't hurt each other because it fucking hurts, man. Why am I getting light? Why am I getting lightheaded talking? Yeah, this ain't good, man. But anyways, uh, hope everybody has a good weekend. Everybody has a good weekend. And, uh, yeah, I love all these, man. All right? So take care. All right. Later.